Crews are getting a temporary dam in place tonight in Tempe. It's been two weeks since the dam broke at Tempe Town Lake. New tonight, ABC 15's Dave Biscoving shows us how much the new dam could cost and how soon it could be in place. Just, just, boof, like that. Henry Moore still remembers the sound. Look at this now. You don't see no one. It's sad. Two weeks later, it's still a mess out here, and Henry and his kids are like many others who stop, stare, and snap some pictures. She cleaned this place up. The city of Tempe is trying, but repairing a man-made lake to hold billions of gallons of water isn't easy. Certainly our focus now is to... Uh complete the replacement of the four bladders that will be there for a five-year period. At City Hall, Assistant Manager Jeff Kalaga says they should have a temporary dam up in a few months. And the good news, at least in the short term, it won't cost the city or taxpayers because the original manufacturer is taking care of the dam bill. And they're paying $3 million of the replacement cost of these four bladders. But a permanent solution to this problem will not be cheap. In fact, a 2008 study looked at what it would take to replace the dam and focused on three options. An all-rubber dam, like the old one, costing $84 million and lasting 15 years. A rubber and steel dam, costing $47 million and lasting 60 years. Or a steel and concrete dam, costing $52 million, also lasting 60 years. Certainly something unfortunate occurred, to say the least. The city will take the next year to figure out its options. And while a quick fix is on the way, for now, people here just want this damn thing back to normal. Oh, that's an eyesore. Work is already underway on that temporary dam. In fact, on Monday, they'll be taking this crane down into the lake to pull out the old sections, and each of those weigh more than 40 tons. Reporting live in Tempe, I'm Dave Biscoving, ABC 15 News.